So lately, I've had to do some videos explaining to first-time home buyers uh, a breakdown of their fees. And yes. the videos have been great because they really understand when they see it and I'm talking to them yes. about it. But sometimes there's things like transfer taxes yes. or owner's title policy yeah. that are generally usually seller's pay its yes. costs. And everything can be like right. used as a negotiating tool. But what fees belong to who and who yeah. pays for what? That's a great question, and you know this mm -hmm. probably as well as anybody. In general, the buyers got a lot of lender fees, right. and the sellers got the commissions, and then their half of escrow, and their seller title policy. So the way it generally works is the buyer has their closing costs. It's usually between what? Maybe like 1% to 3%. That's right, yeah. Depending on prepaids and that mm -hmm. kind of things. And the great news about you guys is I've noticed they can either add that into the rate, you can do a lender mm -hmm. rebate, mm -hmm. so they can come in with only their down payment, yeah. even if the seller is not paying any of their cost. Mm -hmm. On the seller side, it's documentary transfer tax. You know that one, right? It's yeah. what the county charges. The seller's title policy, the escrow, and whatever the commission is, it's usually about 1% over that for your closing costs. Right. And some of the negotiable things that sellers usually pay are like the home warranty plan, mm -hmm. And then it's things like um, the termite. Now, you and I both know very rarely do you actually need a termite clearance to do a loan. Right. Unless it's a VA. Right. And then you need a Section 1 and Section 2 mm -hmm. clearance. Mm -hmm. So there's really specifics. And there's certain VA buyer costs that they can't pay for, right? Yeah, it gets a little funny with VA stuff, how we can move things around. So without getting too much in the weeds, basically... The buyers got their list of costs. The sellers got their list of costs. The buyers are from one to three percent, in addition to what their down payment is, and the sellers is one, usually about one percent over whatever the commission is. Mm -hmm. So we've got an information package that we can give any of your viewers that would like it, and it will really allocate those, and we'll talk to them specifically about it. I love it, and I think that it's important that you bring this stuff up because we are in a market where a lot of people are coming out of, you know, off the fence and deciding right. to buy and yeah. it's their first home and they haven't really had the experience or knowledge. And then sometimes there's mixed information out there. And so I love that you as an agent know so much about that part of the loan, Thank the deal you. and the loan side yeah. of things because there's it's far and few between, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and, and this is the thing. There's so many ways that we can make it happen and a win-win for the client by knowing the different ways to do things. Yeah. You know, just like with your experience and my experience, we know when we team up on stuff, there's so many ways that people can, you know, get their objective solved with the assets that they have. Right, and just say, hey, I am looking to do this. My intent is this, yeah. and vocalize that with your agent yeah. and loan officer so that we can, you know, set you up on a successful track. Absolutely. Right? That, that's well, the way it works. Thanks for sharing that, and Thank I'm excited you. for people to learn and, and really Me learn too. this part of the transaction. Cool. Thank you so much. Thank you all for watching Inside the Masterminds.